The one who amazingly in those hundreds gonna tune my guitar real quick for me, y'all. But I, um, I really am loving this city. Um, I want to come back and uh, make lots of friendships here because I've had a beautiful experience. I ate a beef on a whack, right? <laughs> Changed my life. Changed my life. Hey, I'm from Texas. I had my first one too. <laughs> I had to order because I didn't know what the hell it was. You know. How many of you guys? Y'all got the best pizza. The best wings. No question. I don't even eat pizza. Wings in Texas. I suck. Yeah, I'm Mexican. 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 God bless them. I'm headed back tomorrow. Two months. Oh, gotta get some last minute pizza. Right? I'm like, I was thinking about taking the one that many of us back with. Hurrah! Hurry and get close in the room. They're all looking at you. They don't know you're free. You lay in Jackie's face with a house with a house Now I'll seek you out. I know why you hide. I will keep you out. I love you from the other side. so much so mama's sitting the road and um so when people ask me where i live right now um I, i'm like it's in various space in the misty consciousness now yes yes the best that's the best right buffalo <laughs> the next 24 hours my friend MB, she and tells me to just have a bedroom somewhere. Oh, no. Just bedrooms no, you'll all be over. No, man. You'll have that motor hit. That oh, motor home with the Harley on the back. <laughs> I wish. But it's a crazy thing. Uh, what is home and who is home. Like and a toy carrier. That's what this song's kind of about. Yeah, pull it right up the back. Little toy carrier. 
torch lamp making workshop. for tour and what actually happened is there was no going back home so I've had to build um, like a tour like a whole tour bag and everything out of my buddies and this is my friend MB's guitar so I'm so grateful it's been um, really quite a heist and, and I'm glad I've followed through with it because I've been having a blast so it's worth it so thank you for listening you guys want to hear a brand new song I read in Nashville about busting my ass it's actually about getting my heart Broken daggers pounding on top. Yeah, no, it's about Nashville. It's about Nashville. <laughs> I was feeling very demanding. Thankfully, I was with really great friends because I'm a really early morning riser, and I was like wailing this. And they come out and they're all they're like, "Oh, you wrote a song about Nashville." I'm like, "Yes, I did." Morning time, cold how fast you're out here in no safety net. Not meant to love you back, hallelujah, you got free. Drawing out a nothing line in a cello tree, wanna have a good time. Found a friend who knows you get busted up and you dead. Just because I'm in Nashville When they smile and say they love I gotta aim high If you don't want to stay in love Solitary street line Whoa, you got those heavy hands Why can't you give your mind To help you out Distant game. I'm tired in the kitchen, calling down your blood. Music city, they can love good and pretty. Only dove in the Nashville when they smile and say they know. Well, you gotta aim high if you don't want to stay. I'm 
I just gave her uh, the rest um, of what I had. <laughs> I'm like Brian right in that now. way, man. I have found Should I? across the country that um, this interaction was dearly missed, and um, and there's no place I'd rather be. So thanks, guys. Nice. This is another one off the. Um, thank you. Thank you. Off of um, the record I have available right now called The Offering. This is called Siren. CD or I wrote this in New York. I was, um, well, my tour manager can contest this, but uh, this is what I'm, I've decided upon uh, as reality. <clears throat> um, I was, oops, sorry. Sorry about that, microphone. No hard feelings. Um, I, uh, <laughs> I, was, I was walking, and um, I saw, it was raining in New York City, and I saw the lights on the puddle reflecting, and this song just kind of came through. So it's called Sire. It just takes her to hear what I can do with her. Oh, yeah. The littlest of things. Well, she's out west, too. Yeah, yeah. I like her. Call her Never heard. Never heard. I wouldn't expect it of her marriage. A young lady out of the Hey, hey. <laughs> Will I play better? I don't know. <laughs> it's so painful. Well, we're, we're already laying down ground. It's so flash and light. She said something about my hair. Oh, yeah. It's so dope. It's great. <laughs> it's so locust and light. Color. That's what you know. It's so lambent. It's so lush. So I gelled it up a little bit to the flowers. So lambent. It's in the
um, that I have available. Um, this one is called Moon. Um, so, come on, man, Texas dog. So, at the end of the song is a real grimoire. Who knows what a grimoire is? It's a spell. Um, and I don't know what made me think that, that would be a great idea to put a spell on radio across the world. And but I just feel like it's probably positive. And um, uh, but I did think I should probably not um, cut any corners with using said spell. So I got permission from the author who had passed on, but I sort of asked for permission but did it anyway. And so the day it went to print, I got permission from the publisher to use it. And so I think about Raven Gramasi, who wrote this grimoire spell, going across airwaves doing God knows what, but we like it. Stay right there. I want blood this side Foam belly man Hanging in the bone Summer night Stay right there But I don't want to forget Soft signs are letting bad things that haven't happened yet I collect myself and I want you to see strange things that happen to me. Oh, let them. Therapist by day. Um, 
And uh, um, that means all sorts of things, but one thing it definitely means is I, do, I hang out with sadness a lot. And um, I'm sort of built for it. <clears throat> and, uh, um, but I had this one day at work um, um, that I just felt uh, really um, kind of closed in on all sides by this, the sadness, especially I worked through the pandemic and um, the things people were experiencing were just heart-wrenching. And, um, and so I um, came home and I wrote Sadness a Lullaby, and, and this is it. I was like, if you're loud talking for Tom Petty, I can take loud talking to you. I'm just saying. <laughs> All right. So, um, I was really weird when we got to be around people again. Um, I thought it was the weirdest thing ever. I felt really weird about it. Um, I'm a I'm a naturally kind of introverted, pers quiet person, um, and uh, um, but then. It sort of broke me open, whoops. And um, I felt reconnected to the world again. And I know we're all experiencing that on different levels. And um, I hope we're, you're being tender with that process because I know we're all over the scale on it. And um, But I had one day that I was just elated, elated about being able to hang out with other people. And I wrote this song. Thank you. 
at Newport Folk Festival and cry about it like me? Did you see it? She performed for the first time um, how many years, Nick? Since, yeah. Anyway, it was amazing. She's um, one of the biggest musical influences in my life. I, I grew up with my mom, listening to her. Um, and uh, so yeah, every time I watch it, I, I cry. But I thought I'd pull this out of the vault See what I can do about it. Do we have Joni, any Joni fans in the room? Okay. I can't smile aggressively at people when I try to play Joni Mitchell. <laughs> I'm going to 
very, very grateful to be here. I'm grateful that um, I busted my ass in Nashville and I could still finish out this tour. Um, it's really given me a lot <laughs> to be surrounded by people who um, uh, just just want, want, want the music and I'm so grateful. But anyway, um, this is the title track off my record. Um, oops, you guys, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I have a broken shoulder, didn't I tell you that? Um, I, I'm just kidding. I have nothing to do with my shoulder. Uh, but um, yes, by record, I'm at Xanthi Alexis everywhere. I think I'm like the only one. If Xanthi Alexis did it, it was probably me. I'm sorry. Um, and, uh, um, and I really hope to come to Buffalo again because uh, I've, I've really been taken by y'all. You guys are a bunch of sweethearts. And um, tell your friends. And so um, the, the reason why I put the offering out in the middle of the pandemic when a lot of people told me not to do that um, is because it, um, it was a message of healing that came to me um, uh, that I knew was right for the times that we were in. And, um, and I'm just so happy that we made it through. <laughs> so happy. So, um, so like, yeah, I love everything. Again, I'm Xanthi Alexis. Thanks to Leland Sundry. Thanks so um, much to uh, um, Duende. This is an incredible place. I'm coming back. And um, thanks to Kevin for the sound. And um, whoa, I, I think they're going to let us go over there and go inside of it. So somebody spot me so I don't bust my ass again. And we'll be good. <laughs>
your transgressions The pardon at the gates of love So the love may be Thanks for dropping by, everybody. We'll see you all next time. That was uh, Xanthia Alexis and Leland Sundries before that. Have a good night, guys.